have you heard the news? It's Gary's Food Reviews. Tastes the chops and juice. Puts it on YouTube. A certified palate, second to none. Come watch Gary, that's us some fun. An overall win from 10 to 1. It's Gary's Food Reviews. Hello, and welcome to another episode in Gary's Food Review. And I'm going to mix Cocoa Pops with Captain Crunch Peanut Butter Crunch. Mm. So I got it all mixed up, so let's give it a try. <laughs> mm. Really nice Cocoa Pops and Peanut Butter Crunch. Hmm. So yeah, that combination was really, really good. It's even better than the Reese's Peanut Butter Cup cereal. I mean, the chocolate from the Cocoa Pops is better chocolate than the chocolate that's in the Reese's Peanut Butter Cup cereal. And then the Peanut butter crunch from Captain Crunch. The peanut butter cereal tastes stronger and more peanut butterish than the peanut butter that's in the Reese's cereal. So combine Cocoa Pops for that nice good Cocoa Pop chocolate and Captain Crunch peanut butter crunch with that nice strong peanut butter. The combination of a strong good chocolate and a strong good peanut butter. Combine those two cereals for an awesome peanut butter-ish type cereal that's better than the actual cereal. So yeah. Really good combination, really strong chocolate. The peanut butter is just as equally strong. So you get both of the good strong flavors at once. So it's a nice combination. So I recommend you try this if you're curious for a really good chocolate peanut butter cereal. So with that said, overall, on the food taste scale overall, I would have to, give, I, excuse me, I would have to give, see that cereal made me all hyped up. I would have to give the Cocoa Pops and Peanut Butter Crunch combined a, da da da, a 9 out of 10. Highly, highly recommend you do this. Anyways, this is it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until next time, I'll catch you all later. Bye-bye.